Hello everyone, it's Zyradium. Today we're going to go ahead and um, show you how to fly a helicopter right now in 2022. Okay. So, what we want to do is press right on the trigger. For PS4, it's right... Give me a minute. Let me turn this audio down. So we want to put right on R2. Press that. Now we're up. Now if you want to go down, you gotta press, um, I think it's L1. Right, a uh, left trigger. Yeah. Practice on that. Press right trigger. And left trigger. Right. Left. All right. Okay, now. Let's try to move around. But what we're gonna rely on is the left joystick or left toggle button. So let's go ahead and see if we can go forward. We just... The way- this is the trick about this one. You just use your left toggle button, your left joystick just to move in place. Like, I'm just going straight. But if I stop still, look, if I stop still... I need to go ahead and move myself again. Just press left toggle button. I just need momentum, that's the thing I need. So I have to go straight like this. Down, I mean, a little up with the joystick, and then I should be go flying a little up. Now, let's say I want to turn to the right. Gotta use the right toggle button on the right. But I also want to keep facing forward. So what you want to do is go right and then you're going to press left on the bumper. Just so you can see. So left on the bumper and right on the joystick. Left on the bumper, right on the joint joystick. Just keep a practice right here, guys. Oh, and also, if we want to face the same way, we got to use our right joystick as well. The right joystick is to move our camera. The left one is just to move our helicopter. So just keep that in mind. There's like a lot of buttons you have to press while flying this, but you'll get it, the hang of it. It just, it just takes practice. And if I want to go on the left, I do it the other way so left on the joystick to go left but I want to keep looking forward so I'm gonna press right on the bumper and I'm still gonna uh, control my right um, right joystick to keep to keep looking straight my connect but my connection on my controller is kind of broken so it's gonna be kind of hard but, um, should be able to see what I'm doing. Alright, now if we want to go move a little back, just press left on the button. I mean, press down on the joystick, left joystick. Yeah, but we gotta press, but we still gotta press uh, right on the, on the trigger so we're able to accelerate. And keep in mind, left and right bumper, you gotta control that to look at where you're going with the map. Actually, no, right. It's the right <laughs> joystick. There's a lot of buttons you gotta you gotta move with. The the left and right bumper is just to look around with the helicopter. This is moving yourself as a human. See, look at your camp, your character. But let's see here. What else should I say? So let's go to let's go to the let's go to the airfield. Okay. So we're just gonna press right on the trigger and just keep going straight up with the left joystick. Now, if you want to go higher, 
you're gonna press right on there, you just gotta let go of the joystick, just press right on the, hold right on the trigger, R2. Now let's see if we can park this, we wanna go low to land at the, at the airfield. We gotta press right on the tri right on the trigger again. But um, we don't want to have we want to have a soft landing. So just take it one just one step at a time. Just kind of like like a little tap on the right on the left trigger. Just kind of play with it because you don't want to go all the way down fast. Else you're gonna crash the the helicopter. A little just a little tap. And there we go. Now let's move around again. Gotta press around the trigger. And we gotta go left. I mean, we gotta go up with the joystick so we can start moving. So when you're pressing right on the trigger and left on the joystick at the same time, you're not gaining any altitude, all right? The only way you can gain altitude if you just let those, the joystick. And then look, I'm my helicopter is going up. Now, if we want to turn around, obviously, we gotta press left. We gotta re rely on the bumpers, like I said. So let's go around the track and see. If we can do this right, go straight. Now we want to turn around here. Gotta press left on the on the on the bumper as we're moving with the joystick and the right trigger, and we go again straight. Now, if we want to press uh, on the now, if we want to turn around on the right side, you gotta press right on the bumper. Make sure. Slow it down if you need to. Don't have to go fast. Now, if you're in a hurry and you think you feel like you're about to hit something, you gotta pre you gotta hold that left that left uh, trigger. Slow down, but you don't want to go too fast. Like I said, if you're still a beginner, just take. Just fly slowly with the helicopter. You don't have to rush it. Alright. Now we're going to go ahead and teach you guys how to um, kill player or vehicles with a helicopter. So we're going to do a mission right now here. Press Hent Hunter. Alright. Let's go over here. I move myself around. Now, the other, the, the way you're able to um, have your missiles is you gotta press. I believe it's X or Square for PS4. You can switch it, you can have homing off, homing on, homing on, missiles will lock on, missiles will lock off, and then you can have the machine guns too, so you can switch. But I want to lock on since, let's just say, I am just started the game. Alright, we want to stay back though, we want to keep our distance because these guys have really good aim. Alright, destroy that. We'll, we'll take care of that guy later. Let's go around the other guys over here. Slowly, we're keeping our distance. 
Alright, there we go. Now, there's gonna be uh, the targets where we gotta kill them. Uh, they're just gonna be standing by themselves. So, we are able to lock onto them, but let's just say we are not able to lock on, or it's really hard. We wanna make it, um, we wanna keep our distance away, but we also wanna hit them. So, just in case, if you don't wanna lock on, just press X and you have homing off. Now, you wanna try to aim where the square is on your, the, where your helicopter is aiming. So, Give me a minute. Alright. Now, it's easier to do this in first person, but I'm gonna see if I can do it in third person. I have the square where the corner where he's hiding, as you can see. And... Okay. You gotta move... You're gonna have to move your bumper and a little bit of the left... Mostly the left joystick is how you're gonna aim up and down, so... I'm almost there. Take your time. Almost there. Alright, there we go. Now, I'm gonna show you how to do it in first person. And it's actually a little bit easier, but... the first person, you're not gonna be able to see where you're going. Or you're not going to be able to see your surroundings, like building and stuff, so you got to be careful when you do it in first person. So, to do first person, you got to press left on the the small button. I believe it's the... Well, for PS4, it's the share button, but for me, it's the... I believe it's the two small squares. I'm not sure what that is called, but yeah. Press twice, and you're first person. Now we're gonna, you can obviously, you can do this, uh, you can lock on. Gotta be careful with your sound, just fly slowly. Lock on, but I don't wanna lock onto that guy, cause that's not the guy we're after. We're after this guy, so I'm gonna put homing off, and see if we're able to get him in our square. Right here, and... Helicopter is very delicate, so you gotta be careful. And aim for our left joy. Close, close. So close. I'm almost dead. In a minute. Alright. Alright, there we go. We gotta aim very... The thing about um, homing off, you gotta have to... You're gonna have to have a little... Uh, have to have good aim with the air helicopter and you're gonna have to see if you can fly your helicopter smoothly. It's really about all the buttons that you need to press, like right left and right a bumper, and then this is gonna go up and down with your helicopter, and then you're gonna have to keep flying, so. But yeah, it just, it just takes time and practice, so hopefully that was helpful. And just let me know if this video was, you know, was very helpful for you guys. You're welcome.